and get ready to immerse yourself into the Lebanese culture. The 23rd annual Lebanese festival starts today in Roanoke and we are joined by Don Silik to tell us more about it. Now, 23 years, yes. what keeps y'all wanting to keep doing this every year? I think it is that we get to show our culture once a year and the people that come are just so friendly and sit and enjoy after they eat. A lot of them will sit and listen to the music and then we have dancing usually at least twice each day. So they wait for the youth group to do our Lebanese dancing. And um, part of our Lebanese culture is just to show what we're all about. And we love people and music and of course, food. That's oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a good time. Yeah, let's talk about the traditional dancing. A few years yeah. ago, I was out at the <laughs> church and learning the traditional dances. It's a fun time, my goodness. It is, it really is. And we'd love to have pe people come up and just join the line and just watch. If you watch somebody else's feet, you just pick it up right away and everybody has a good time and nobody cares if you miss a step. Yeah, no, <laughs> not at all. Now we got to talk about the food that you brought of because course. it smells amazing. <laughs> talk about what's on this platter. Well, we have um, both, this is our lamb shish kebab, this is our beef, these are our vegetarian green beans, which are, have a little oh. bit of a tomato in them. And we put it over rice if you'd like. If not, you could eat it by your, itself. We also offer the green beans with lamb, if you'd prefer some meat. We have a lot of vegetarian um, choices for people. Our hummus is vegetarian. These are our meat grape leaves, and they yeah. have ground beef and rice in them, but we also offer a vegetarian grape leaf. And then those are our cabbage rolls. And um, we also um, have our sandwich roll-ups. We'll have the outside ladies and men wrapping sandwiches all day long. Oh my gosh. And you can just amazing. smell the grill. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And EC has been raving about y'all's the so grape wrapped. leaves, yes, yeah. the stuffed grape leaves, they're so good. But y'all know what else is good? The desserts, okay? Okay. <laughs> I'm sitting here. These desserts look so good. Can you tell everybody about those? Sure, sure. <laughs> um, this one is our, what we call gravy, and it is like a butter cookie. Oh, it's got okay. a pistachio filling, and it literally melts in your mouth. Oh, my gosh. And this is our butlewa and it's phyllo dough with ground nuts and um, sugar inside of it. And we use a simple syrup. It's not extremely sweet. It's sweet, but not extremely sweet. We have a coconut cookie. This one is filled with ground nuts. This one is filled with dates. And this is a farina cookie. Okay. And uh, it is more of a grainy feeling, but delicious. Okay, so, so many good yeah. treats to take part in. For of this. course, of That's course, right. yes. Well, thank you for joining us this morning. You will be back with us, so make sure y'all stay uh, tuned in. But the Lebanese Festival is happening today and tomorrow from 11 a.m. to 9 p.m. and Sunday from 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. Now, admission and parking is free, so make sure you head out. It's going to be a gorgeous day. It is, and we also are prepared if it rains Sunday. We've got tents, we have indoor seating, a lot of indoor seating. So we're prepared, but hopefully we'll have good weather. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, looking forward to it. Thank you so much. Thank you, ladies. Yeah, thank you. Y'all stay with us. We'll have more coming right up.